all one community at West Carville Middle School made up of many different races, ethnicities, and cultures. While we all have our differences, we also have one important thing in common, humanity. Our common goal is to support, encourage, and accept all students. Our differences make us stronger, and by appreciating those differences, we are able to create a climate of inclusivity. So, what does it mean to be inclusive? The word inclusion means to create an environment that recognizes, appreciates, and utilizes the skills, talents, and perspectives of every student. By talking and listening to one another, we learn and increase our understanding. Here are some examples of how you can practice inclusion. Talk to someone from another culture that you have never met before. Listen to others when they are speaking. Make a new friend. Share something about yourself. Discover similarities. Respect one another. Remember the feelings of others must be respected. Do not use stereotypical language or disrespect which you do not understand. Look for opportunities to understand more about cultures other than your own. Respectfully ask questions you are unsure about the appropriateness of a topic or comment. Use your words to encourage and inspire others. Do you know at West Carville Middle School we have students from 19 different countries who speak 20 different languages? Some of the countries represented at our school include Venezuela, India, Jordan, Korea, and Mexico. We also have students who speak many languages such as Hindi, Korean, Spanish, Arabic, and Tamil. That's amazing. It just shows how diverse we are at West. We are very proud of our Hall of Flags. Take a moment as you walk past the library to see some of the flags that represent students who attend our school. More will be added soon. Here's another interesting fact about our school. We currently have over 1,200 students who attend WCMS, and each of us have unique gifts and talents. Our personalities and styles are unique. We all think and feel differently. Our likes and dislikes aren't exactly the same. We may have different complexions, hairstyles, health concerns, families, religions, and languages, and more, but that's what makes us great. We should celebrate our differences because that's what makes the world so exciting. We should be grateful for all of these differences. Things would be pretty boring if everyone was the same. And for our differences make the world a very exciting and innovative place. Unfortunately, sometimes we use these differences as an excuse to treat other people without kindness and respect. We say hateful things to people, make fun of how they look, judge them for their beliefs, and exclude them because they are not like us. We use our words to hurt others and our actions to make them feel that they do not belong in our community. This is not who we are at West. We want to be good citizens of great character. When we do this, we are creating an environment where everyone feels safe and appreciated. Every person deserves to be included and should feel that they're special and belong here at West. If we allow our peers to treat each other with hatred because of differences, then we are a part of the problem. All students should be treated with respect and shown kindness at our school and all means all. So what can we do as a school community to make the change? How do we become a school that doesn't just talk about being kind and respectful, but demonstrates these things in our everyday actions? Let's strive to be examples of what inclusion really means. Our challenge is to take the time to talk to someone you've never talked to before. Meet a new friend and learn something unique about this person. Always choose to be kind in your words and actions. Try to understand new points of view and feelings while appreciating and respecting diversity. Finally, remember and practice the golden rule. Treat others how you would like to be treated and more importantly, treat others how they would like to be treated. We have the power to make a difference and our voices can be heard. So let's make our community a place where everyone can feel heard, seen, respected, included, and welcome. 2022, we are coming for you.